Yes, ladies and gentle flies, it is the No Filter Effect Show where we keep it 110%. All real, no makeup, no hair, no filter, no wig, no nails, just, just bad. Bad. I'm not alone. I'm here with my favorite dark skin chat shine from the non talk gold caramel. <laughs> I'm not alone. I'm here with Timmy. Timmy, how you doing? Why do you keep doing this to me? What do you mean? What did I do? You introduced me as like this this beautiful light skin dark chocolate, whatever you say. Like, you know, What's wrong with that? This Timmy? is amazing. I love it. Yeah. I'm just saying, like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I deserve it. <laughs> Guys, stop. So how yeah. you doing? How's been your week, man? I've been trying to keep up with this uh, Nelly and oh, yeah. Tembe situation with U, U, AK and stuff like that. And uh, Yeah, so finally, like, uh, the, the funeral happened. You know, they laid um, Nelly's body to rest yeah. um, on Friday. Same day, actually, as they laid um, the Prince. small little girl called um, Lungil. Right. Um, from yeah. South Africa who got bullied in school and took her own life. Yeah. Um, so they had their um, funerals on the same day. Now, um, it was so sad to see the pictures of AKA just sitting by himself. I know it's self-isolating, but like no one was even there to like, you know, comfort him. And him just pictures of cir- circulating of him sitting there by himself looking at this box you know, of the person that he loves laying inside of it. And people were really, like, pouring their hearts out on Twitter, man. People are sad. I mean, we shouldn't be surprised, man. Like, we spoke last week about how, like, this is possibly um, such a dark time for him. Yeah. And uh, we, we can't forget that we are in COVID at the minute. So uh, social distancing and, and things like that, like, he's going to end up being... Uh, by himself, which he, he did end up being like just um, while watching the whole process yeah. and the whole, um, what do you call it? The memorial and stuff. Yeah. Like he, he was going to sit in his own seat. The mother of the, of Uanele and the father, like everyone had their own spaces. Yeah, yeah, so obviously true. like, a, yeah, like, you know, at that moment mm. of the whole ceremony, that that's what, what was going to happen. Yeah. Do you get what I mean? Yeah. So, yeah. I hear what you're saying. And I think, um, well, as I was watching, because I, I was watching the whole thing, because I didn't want to miss anything, because I know people on YouTube will be telling me, hey. give us the, the hey. receipts, big, give hey. us. Give us real information. So I was watching, trying to listen to every single word the father was saying, like, okay, this is what the family thinks. And he this said is a what, lot, you know. He, he said things that are scary, bruh. He, he said a lot. basically said that she didn't have a history of depression. Yeah. He downplayed anything to do with depression. Um, he said that she was a joyful child. Like, we never knew of such as the family that she was yeah. going for anything like this. He also stated that she didn't jump. Mm. So, you know, it kind of raises the question. So was she pushed? Did she fall by accident? There's, you see, I was re-watching this thing mm. multiple times, especially after what people were saying in the comments. Yeah. Not that it affected me or yeah. anything, but... Uh, I was trying to listen to see like, no, man. Okay, so these guys are saying, no, you guys don't have all the information. Yeah. Can we get some facts? So now I'm talking from the horse's mouth. Okay. Which is the father of this late lady. Yeah. And rest in peace again, Mm -hmm. Anele. Rest in peace again. But he said until she was 21, there was no history. Exactly. Of of such and such of Mm -hmm. I'm a depression Mm -hmm. and 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 such and And bear in mind she's 22 yes okay yes Mm -hmm. yes she passed away at 22 Mm -hmm. so if i speak now like i'm talking from a person i'm 28 i was never gonna say my age online but no 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 it doesn't matter like i need to make this clear yeah at 28 yeah Mm -hmm. like um my mother has already got assumptions about me mm-hmm. that she says to other people. Exactly. That she thinks, no, is you. Me, this, this is, this is yeah. how do me is. But yeah. really, exactly. like you have no idea what I'm doing. Exactly. You That's see, you, say, you, show you, me see your you see, you see exactly yeah. what you would like uh, as a parent for to me see. to be. Yeah. So, um, I think that statement of his where he was like, so, well, when she got to 21, we, we never seen this. We never knew. But there was obviously... Um, something afterwards that kind of triggered it to to towards such a thing. Then he mentioned things about drugs, drug use, and he mentioned yeah. that if he, obviously if you 
abuse substances, yeah. you can reach a state of depression and become like this. Mm-hmm. And, you know, a lot of people were saying, so he's basically saying, and then she met AKA. Yeah. Which is the difficult part. Which is like, really? It's a very difficult part because... You can't do that. Well, AKA, like they've said, like I said before, we're not accusing my man of this and exactly. that. But he is known to have dabbled. Of course. In, in such... You know, things. lifestyles. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. So um, maybe, maybe as the family say, like she was never into that until she met... Mm-hmm. Is it Keenan? They say yeah, Keenan. Yeah, Keenan Forbes. And the guy, the guy never mentioned AKA once. He just he mentioned exactly. his, his, his real, his exactly. real. Exactly. <laughs> he was like, "I'm not dealing with that guy. You guys know, no. I'm dealing with this guy, this mm. young boy that came to marry my daughter, and yeah. this is his name." Yeah. yeah. And I, it's so painful because watching that, I was like, "How are you gonna bring?" The, for all we know, AKA could be dealing with substance abuse. Like he's, it's something that he's trying to maybe help himself with as well in the process of helping Nelly. He, maybe he was like, you know yeah. what, if you can do it, I'll try it too, yeah. you know? So yeah. maybe this is something he's trying to deal with. Yeah. And now for you to bring it up in such a moment, mm. you know, to bring the lifestyle in such a moment, because this is what people were saying about Bobby Brown and Whitney Houston. And it took like- It's funny you say that. Whitney- I was actually going to bring it up. It's funny <laughs> and it took that, Whitney yeah. Houston's best friend to say like, before she met, Bobby, she was already abusing something. Mm. It's just that the two put together was two energies that just fired up a whole yeah. new kind of lifestyle. So I wouldn't say that maybe she she met or did what she was doing because of AKA. Yeah. But like you're saying, parents won't know that she if she was, they wouldn't know that she'd be doing such things. Yeah. They wouldn't see her going outside like that. They wouldn't see her taking whatever she's taking. So to them, they don't see that side of her. It's the only the only reason I brought it up is because um just to state facts, like he did mention, look, since twenty one, no, like Yeah. We've never seen this. Yeah. So that means after twenty one uh, her father, maybe she went in a different direction. Yeah. And then I don't know much information. I'm just talking about what I see from what was yeah. said. Is that maybe she went a different direction and he didn't really see what was going on, but he did see that, no, there was some sort of substance abuse. Yeah. Which is why he was very adamant saying, no, my girl didn't jump. Mm-hmm. She wouldn't, apparently. She would never do such yeah. a thing. But obviously, I know she was around such and such, mm-hmm. which is why he was so um, able to say to AKA, like, by the way, man, I understand what you. Yeah. No, no, there was a, there was a very specific thing he said. He said, I can understand what you're going through. Mm. But like my son, which is what I loved about the father. He yeah, was like, yeah. he still called him his son. Yeah, yeah. Which means like he's not he's not blaming him about anything. He's like, no, I still call you my son. Yeah. You know what I mean? But there's still a way like, you know, you need to deal with certain things yeah. without such and such. True. And my mistake maybe last week when I was saying, AKA was saying, um, when I was saying, Ooh, he took it to counseling mm-hmm. and stuff. It turns out, no, the father was saying before you guys get married. Oh, you need to be courtshiping and counts- marriage counseling. Exactly. So maybe that's where I got it wrong. I thought to AKA was doing that anyway. Okay. But it turns out the father was saying no. Uh, you guys need to do this before you get married. But it was for marriage. It wasn't for like addiction. Right. You know, it, it, it's different, of course. Yeah, yeah. So like, I don't know whether they deal with such in marriage counseling. They talk about addictions and like, you know, substances and maybe if it controls the relationship to some extent, I guess. But I think if, you, if you're going to go counseling, you're going to touch upon... A lot of things. Yes, aren't you? And uh, maybe the father saw something that he he felt as if like, okay, no, I accept the labalolo, um, you know, all of that stuff. Mm-hmm. But you guys are young, yeah. Like, why don't you why don't you try this before we'll you talk get to into, someone first? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. That being said, not like, do you think now because he's calling him son, like, is he gonna get the labola back? This is the the labola money. This is what I want to know. Is the bottle thing really important at the moment? It's not. It's just because he's also lost. Yeah. As the groom. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Would he then have to take out money food for the funeral? If it was, would he then have to pay the family for you know 
is this i'm sure there's something where you pay like oh sorry if it was up to me because i don't want to i don't want to try being sensitive and include yeah. money because yeah. this is very fresh true you understand this true. is very fresh i would like to say had i paid lobola and you would know, you leave it there and 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 that happened to the person i love i'm not even going to think about the money true. i'm not even going to think about lobola i'm actually going to ask the parents what they need what else do you need I, I hear what you're saying yeah i, I hear what to. you're saying yeah well anyway shout out to aka if you know him if you see him if you bump into him somewhere please give him a shout out give him some love show him some love he's going through a lot but for all of those that are out there still enjoying life living life to the fullest yeah trust me like every day is special every day is is a new opportunity a new chance to do something that you will never regret yes yes a new blessing a new yes. moment Yes. So live it to the max. I'm still out here playing DJ Fisto. Shout out to him if you're listening. I know you're a fan. Um, we're out here doing South African music all the way, all the way. But I need to, I need to just say one thing before we end Give this. Give it to us, I need to say one thing before we end this. Yes, uh, mental health is a taboo in mm-hmm. our African culture. Mm-hmm. Yes, depression is a taboo in our culture. Mm-hmm. We need to learn that, yes, our parents think of us this way and that way. Yeah. But guys, yo... We need to start talking about this. Yeah. This is a very important thing. Yeah. This is a very important thing. Yeah. Yes, your parent might think, oh, Yolanda, you're beautiful. You you do this. No. You've got another life. Of course. If you say to your mom, look, mom, I'm sad today. She can't say, ah, what are you crying about? Yeah. No. She needs to be like, okay, baby, tell me what's up. Okay, I hear you. So be open with fam. Yes. I hear that. And that's all I'm going to say. Mm, to me, my doctor. Doctor, to me. Anyway, we're here with Teacher yeah. Pistols. Come on through. All right.